Hi, this is Ben from LiteratureReviewHQ.com and I'm just going to talk to you for a few minutes about how you can get other people to either critically review the literature for you or uh, give you a, a masterclass in how to critically review the literature for yourself by joining or starting your own journal club. So critical reading is, is often one of the most difficult parts of doing a literature review. It's especially difficult when you're just starting to do literature reviews or you've changed field, you've changed discipline and you're having to get to grips with a lot of new literature and you're also having to learn how to critically analyse it because each different subject area has their own ways of, of criticising things and has their own kind of inside knowledge about how how to perform certain techniques, how to do certain things, and, and that affects how you analyse things critically. So my the, the best way that I've learned to, to critically analyse literature is to learn from other people. And the best way to do this is by joining a journal club because you learn from the people in the field itself. And although you can learn general techniques in, in lots of other places, in books, online, the way that you really learn how to really subject specifically, uh, critically analyse the literature in your field is to learn from the people in your field. And so join a, a journal club that, that comprises of people who are kind of um, more novices, kind of learning how to to join, how to how to critically analyse the literature, and with more and with people who are experts in the field, you know, more kind of uh, seasoned academics, especially if these people are, are responsible for for looking at the work that you do, because if you're learning from the people who are going to be assessing your work in the future, then you'll learn what they want to see from a literature review and, and learn how they critically analyse the literature. Um, and this is this is great this is a really great forum to learn really really brutally how to critically analyze literature because a lot of people that this is this, this is their favorite parts of being uh, an academic they absolutely love um, tearing other people's work to shreds and, and while that's not necessarily a healthy way to be it really really helps you learn how to pick apart other people's work uh, which is important in in assessing uh, the literature so there's no journal club. Um, well, start your own. Why not? I mean, you only need a few people to do it. Um, check around your department, send emails, start a Facebook group, uh, ask people in person, see if you want to join. Set a date and a time, meet up, and, and away you go. Um, yeah, you start off by kind of giving a brief synopsis of the, the article and then just um, maybe a few questions and try and provoke a discussion. Um it always helps when you're organising these kind of things. Or I find it always helps to kind of bring along a few, a few snacks, maybe pizzas or some donuts uh, to try and encourage people to come along. Um, so yeah, give it a try. And there's not enough people. If you say there's not enough people to to do your your journal club in your department or people don't have enough time to commit to regularly that's not an excuse and arguably, arguably a better way to do this is to go virtual um, host a, a virtual um, journal club why not there's loads of ways to do this so just a few off the top of my head you can go on twitter post a link to the journal with a relevant hashtag to your journal club group and then get people to comment on it in, in Twitter with the hashtag and then you can follow it you can see the thread of the, the discussion and anyone in the, who's on Twitter can can comment um, now arguably the, the comments on Twitter are a little bit short to get in depth so maybe you want to start a Facebook group, post it on Facebook have discussions in the comments there that's great a lot of people are on Facebook, one of the problems I find with that is a lot of academics well, there's kind of split half Half the academics kind of love Facebook and the other half are incredibly reluctant to go on it. And for that, I recommend either start a Google group. So you just have a Google login and you start a group on there and you can discuss things, share journals. And, and that's a really great platform for doing that. 
Um, but probably the best one, to be honest, in terms of a journal club is to start a blog. Start a free blog on Blogger or WordPress.com. Um, each blog post will be um, a, a brief summary of the article and a link to it. And then the comments would be the discussion. And you don't need to, to log in. You know, you can be anonymous if you want, if you're a bit worried about other people. I mean, I don't think it helps to be anon anonymous. I think it's better to, to show who you are. But if some people don't want to, then you can still take advantage of their input without them having to, to give away more than they want to in your comments. Um, so, yeah, I mean, start doing this as early as you possibly can because um, this is you start learning from day one and you only ever get better with time and encourage other people to do it as well because you can then start passing on your knowledge of, uh, of how to, to critically review the literature. Um, so that's my presentation, five minutes. If, uh, if this was useful to you, then please check out some of my posts on literaturereviewhq.com and uh, please share this video uh, if, it was, if you enjoyed it. Thank you very much.